Here it is, your husband. eating a slice of pizza every time he hears the magic word. How many slices you've eaten? Did your mother give you that name or something you picked up at a club one night? Mm -hmm. Sorry, if I interrupted the... <laughs> How many slices you've eaten in reality so far? Five. <laughs> You're slowing down a little, aren't you? Yep. Yeah, okay. And I, how much have I paid you for? I paid you for three. Three. So here's another 20 bucks. Every time you hear that word, you've got to eat another slice of pizza. I'm going to eat. Right? I'm going to eat. At okay. $10 a shot, I'm eating. Okay. Okay, today's show is all about indecent proposals. And I dare you to say yes to my indecent proposal. We've got people here on the show who've uh, been obviously uh, very troubled by their partner's ideas of what they should be doing. We've made, I think, some resolution. But a woman who's going to help us uh, go to the next level on the show, please welcome Rhonda Shear, host of USA Up All Night. Rhonda, how are you, I'm darling? Sorry, like, mm, wait, so how? Oh. Mm. Okay. <laughs> now, Rhonda, yeah. uh, before we go into uh, some of the things you'll be doing for us today, have you ever received an indecent proposal in your career? Um, yeah, actually, once I was asked to wear really uh, sleazy lingerie, um, host tacky films, and squeak up all night. And you did. <laughs> and now I've made a career of it. So, <laughs> hey, the strip thing could work out for you. Um, so, no, actually, of course, daily. Really? Yeah. Is, it's a now you've done thing. you've done B movies and things like that, haven't you? Have oh you... yeah, you mean being chased around offices? I've been chased around some of the best offices in Hollywood. It does exist. What was really scary was at one time this very prominent businessman, well, he had his henchman come over and offer me some money to go to bed with him, and and I didn't know if I was more insulted by that or the fact that he offered me like five hundred dollars and not more. <laughs> <laughs> That's I'm sad. I'm still shocked over that. Well, I'm very glad that you've got a sense of humor. Rhonda's come on today's show because what we're going to do is we're going to send Rhonda out. What have you got in the bag there, Rhonda? I have a big chicken suit. You have enormous, you're with chicken feet. Chicken feet. Chicken head. Chicken heads. Chicken, a chicken body. A chicken body. With, a, with, a, with appropriate dressing. My here's kind what, of man. Here's what we want you to do. <laughs> we yes. want We want you to take that chicken suit. We want you to go out this door. <laughs> so you're getting volunteers. Oh, no, I'm sorry, sir. <laughs> I know you've always wanted to be a chicken, and that's something... <laughs> and that's another show. That really is another show. I'm sure we can help you. But um, we can have an egg farmer come in and consult. But what we want you to do is we want you to go out on the street, and there's a very nice man, Angelo, who does all our shoe work. He's got a lovely little shoe shop just two doors up. Do you mind going up there and oh, asking no, him I, if he dresses a, a I, chicken? I would like to. And, and then later on, will you do that for me? Oh, darling, will you? And jump up and down and sing Old McDonald's? That's what I okay, like. Okay, all right. Straight out of the Ronda Shear, ladies and gentlemen. Her indecent proposal... Okay, I got some money here. I got an audience there. Okay, first thing, I need a lady. I need, okay, you, you up for this? Okay, okay, stand up, ma'am. Here's what I want you to do. Can you sing? No. Can you, you can sing, you can sing? Okay, can you sing? Okay, here's what I want you to do. For 50 bucks, I want you to go up to the, the stage and I want you to sing Old MacDonald's Had a Farm with all the animal noises. All righty. On your knees. Okay, you ready for this? Take my microphone. Okay. And you look terrific. Come on, I'll cut down with you. Come on, I'll come down with you. And what is your name? Tracy. Tracy is now about to sing Old MacDonald Had a Farm with all... If you ain't getting it back. Oh. <laughs> okay. Let's... Where did the money go? Disappeared. I okay, disappeared. all right, let's go. Ready? Come on. You gonna sing with me? Yeah, I'll sing with okay. you. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had some chicks. E-I-E-I-O. With a chick chick hair and a chick chick there. Hair chick, hair chick, hair chick, hair chick. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Terrific, well that's terrific, thank you. Wonderful. You did it. You get to keep the 50 bucks. Uh, okay. 
You know, you have had your hands in the air all show, sir. What is your name? You look like a very enthusiastic individual. My name is Tony. Tony, you're up for something, aren't you? Yes, I you am. You want the 50 bucks no matter what it is, don't it's you? Really okay, well, on today's Indecent Proposals, your Indecent Proposal actually was suggested by these men down here. Gentlemen, yeah, do you want us to... Yes. <laughs> Be nice, be nice, be nice. We have uh, we have $50 for him if yeah. he thinks he has what it takes to be a boxer boy for the day. Oh, man. Okay, there's 20, 30, 40. Here's for, you tell you what, here's what you do. I have no pockets. You got no pocket? You, <laughs> I'm sure it'll stay in there. No, no, no. Okay, you don't get the money afterwards. until afterwards. You got some shorts in the back and okay. we'll dress them up and bring them are up. Are you up for the, you want to see our friend here? What is your name, sir? What is your name? Tony, Tony. Tony. Tony? Okay, Tony. Come on, guys. Take Tony out that door. When he comes back, he's a boxer boy. Thank you, guys. All righty. Uh -uh. Now, coming up, have we got an outside camera? Where is Rhonda? She said, well, she's on her way. When we come back, we're going to check in with Rhonda because Rhonda will be... Uh, there she is with a chicken suit. I'm ready. Are you ready to do this? I can't wait. Okay, when we come back, you're going to go in and see Angelo. He doesn't know you're coming with a chicken suit and a $50 idea. And as well, an exotic dancer who's been offered several indecent proposals for real at work. And now her boyfriend is steamed up and wants her to quit a job. Will she do it? Find out when we return next on The Gordon Elliott Show. <laughs> People are lined up down the block to have their shoes shined by Alex, the one Alex, get back in there. Shine those shoes. Shine. Shine. Look, get down there. Look at them. They're shining everything. They're shining uh, tennis shoes. They're shining socks. Oh. Alex is a fabulous shiner. For your complimentary tickets to the Gordon Elliott Show in New York, give us a call at 212-975-8540. And please be sure to leave us your phone number. So tender, so innocent your gums, so vulnerable to the wicked germs hoping to ravage them. Insidiously, they can build plaque and inflict gum disease. These germs are not fiction, they are in your mouth. Brushing and flossing alone may not stop them. Listerine can. Only Listerine's germ-killing formula is clinically proven to help prevent gum disease. Listerine, the power of prevention. Their germs show no mercy. I used to wonder if I was too old to go back to school. Now I know I wasn't alone. I used to worry about my future. Now I know I have one. I used to wonder if I made the right decision. Now I know I should have called sooner. ITT Technical Institute has six area campuses located conveniently near you. Call 1-800-942-0088 for an informative brochure. If you've been injured in an accident... I was making a left-hand turn, then wham, this truck plowed right into my car. I needed someone on my side who could help. You're entitled to fair and adequate compensation. I knew I had to call a lawyer right away. You need someone to fight for you. I was just getting the runaround from everyone at the insurance company. You don't have to go it alone. My car was wrecked, and I was hurt. I'm Larry H. Parker. Call me at 1-800-333-0000. Now, fighting for you is my job. You looking for something? Yeah, auto insurance I can afford. Tickets? Accidents? He needs his license back. Call Eastwood right now. If you're paying more than $50 a month for auto insurance, call Eastwood now at 1-800-468-LESS. You want auto insurance you can afford? You call Eastwood. Eastwood, we're in the Pacific Bell Smart Yellow Pages under insurance. Norm's Complete Steak and Shrimp Dinner at a shrimply marvelous price. Only $4.99 Monday through Thursday at all Norm's restaurants. Oh, McDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had some chicks. E-I-E-I-O. With a chick, chick here and, and a chick, chick, chick there. Hair, chick, there, chick, and a chick, chick. And chick, 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 ch
Today's guest is saying to their loved ones, I dare you to consider my indecent proposal. I gotta do a reality check. Reality, that's his name, guys. How many how many pizzas of pizza are you? Two more pizzas every time you heard the code word? Every time you see this code word, and he's uh, he's heard it, he's gotta eat another slice of pizza. Can you keep going or do you want us to find a replacement? You can do each other when you want. You keep going. I wanna see you burst with pizza I'm, and cheese. And I'm gonna burst too with money. Okay, all right. He's eaten one entire jumbo pizza. He's going for more. Now, listen, we last sent Rhonda out on our proposal. Rhonda, you have a chicken suit which involves an indecent proposal. We're, hey, yes, you're outside I do. Uh, the shop there? I'm ready to go in. Gordon, Gordon, yeah. Gordon. Yeah, yes, darling. <laughs> I, just, I just wanted to tell you how much I love you and how much I'm enjoying this, How many times this, did you say that? Gordon, 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 you said, Gordon. You Gordon. said Gordon, 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 Gordon. Uh, okay. I love that did name. You, did you hear that reality? Uh, there you go. He's eating them two at a time now. <laughs> <laughs> darling now you know you're outside our local cobbler he That's does know he knows nothing of this so it's up to you no. you got to sell him on the chicken suit idea i'm ready gordon okay <laughs> darling oh there's another slice now remember when you go in Rhonda. yes uh, he's got to he's got to dress up in the chicken suit right. and then he's got to offer free shoe shines on the street all right and, and you're giving him 50 bucks for this we're right? giving him 50 bucks okay you can make it 100 if it looks difficult okay right, on you go i'm ready for you gordon Off you, no go in we want you to do it now okay here we go okay here we go entering <laughs> Alex! Oh, hi there. I'm Rhonda Shear with Gordon Elliott Show. How are you doing? Listen, I have an indecent proposal for you because you're Stop cute. right there. I think you'll enjoy the thought for a minute. <laughs> think about indecent... No, no, no. No, I'm sorry. No, carry on. I just All want right. to see his face. Here we go, Gordon. This is for you. Yes. He's trying to look straight into my eyes. You notice that? Yeah. <laughs> Gordon, what I would like you to do is I... Alex. I would like you, I dare you, close your cash register, <laughs> I dare you to dress up in this chicken outfit, and I will assist you to get into it. Full chicken regalia with the chicken legs, the chicken feet, the chicken head. Go out on the street and give people free shoe, si shoe shines for $50. Would you do what that? Do you, what do you think, Gordon? I mean, what, I mean oh, Gordon, Oh, man. Oh, man. What do you think, Alex? No. Alex? I dare you, Alex. Please, did... Alex. As a matter of fact, why don't you do it for free, okay? All right. Okay. Oh, I'm going to help right. him get dressed. Terrific. Alex, right. so Alex dresses get... up like a chicken, and he's going to offer free shoe shines. That's the kind of neighborhood we live in, a giving, <laughs> caring New York kind of neighborhood. Now, let's move on. Jamie from Salt Lake City is in the show. Please give him a big welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Now... Jamie, you're upset about your girlfriend Tracy's work. What? Why? Garden, 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 <laughs> garden, garden. <laughs> What's up, reality? <laughs> <laughs> I got some Pepto Bismol downstairs. You'll be right. um, she's she's an exotic dancer, and she's a very beautiful woman. And she gets these proposals all the time. And she got one. I'd say it was about a month and a half ago that entailed a lot of money and a lot of other things that went along with the money as far as you know I you, get the, you get the picture anyway she uh she told me about it probably about two weeks after it happened after another one of the girls that she works with told me about it so i wasn't too pleased about it and i asked her why she didn't tell me and she told me basically the reason i didn't tell you is because i know you would have gone in the club and f tried to find out who it was sure. fortunately for him he, he was from out of town so it just didn't go any further right. than that right well, we, we, oh, uh, he's getting, sorry, we just, we want to stop there. <laughs> sorry, he's getting into the chicken suit. Now, it could be worse. Someone could want your wife to dress up in a chicken suit and flap around. That's fine. He's, she he's can a half a chicken. He he's half a chicken right now. He's half a chicken because he can't go any further. <laughs> <laughs> he's a half a chicken. All right, we'll come. He's getting there, look. He's sprouting wings. He's sprouting. You enjoying uh, this? Huh? Liking this? Sure. <laughs> it may lead to a certain taste you can't satisfy, Rhonda. Now, uh, would, Jamie, would you would, do you mind if we bring out your girlfriend? No, not at okay. all. Okay. Do you want to meet Tracy, Jamie's girlfriend? Okay. Come on out. Please. Now, Tracy, what happened? You are. Is this the only time it's happened? No, I've had it happen twice. And what, what, are these, what are these men saying, and what are your responses to it? Well, they just, um, the first one I was offered $3,500 to spend the whole entire evening with somebody, and I turned them down. 
But for the, for a split second, I thought about it. Yeah. It's tempting. Well, what does I thought about it? <laughs> well, I mean, and, and the next one was it. even more I would money, never wasn't do it? it though. The, the, how much was the next offer? Five thousand. Oh. <laughs> well, what goes through your mind when when you hear these kinds of things? Oh, all the all that money Nothing. I could I could spend. I mean, bills, my car payment, my daughter. Sure, you want to look after all your that daughter. Money. And... Yeah. Now, what happens when Jamie finds out about these things? Because you don't want to tell him, but he finds out through uh, your girlfriend. Yes, he gets very upset. Really? Very upset. Well, I mean, if somebody offered me a decent proposal, I think she'd get a little bit upset, too. Yeah, but you'd want to hear from her. Uh, Jamie, well, I yeah. think you'll be okay. Why well for her, or what? why would she consider that? I, I have no idea. I mean, money's not too bad. We got money, so we're all right. <laughs> but you, you, you've said to Jamie that that isn't going to happen. That I wouldn't. No, I would no, never do that. No, you wouldn't do that. No. But um, what ha how, how much of a pressure on the relationship is it? Because I know that you're very upset. I mean, this is no joke for well, you. Well, it's, it's, it's gotten to the point now where, I mean, I trust her and everything, and I, I respect her, and I love her to death. I mean, there's nothing that's going to change that. Right. So I know that she won't do it. So right. I don't have... A, I don't have you know, it bothers me, but I don't want her dancing anymore because sure. I'm getting sick of the phone numbers popping up all over the place. And sure. Now, uh, Tracy, you have a proposal for Jamie, though, don't you, on today's um, show? Well, yeah, Gordon. I was going to um, have a proposal for Jamie, but I'd rather have a proposal for you instead. Uh... <laughs> okay. Okay, this is why I wasn't told too much about this particular part of the show. What is your proposal? I would like for you to be the boxer boy. Oh, you would like me to be the boxer boy. The crowd wants blood and silk boxes. We'll give it to them when we return next on The Gordon Elliott Show. When I saw the old lights of that truck, I knew I was home free. When I pulled out that card, I knew that everything would be okay. These are real AAA members talking about how AAA was there for them. Join AAA now, and we'll be there for you, too. If you lock yourself out, need a jump start or gas, we'll be there even if you're in a friend's car. When I call AAA, I know they'll be there 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. Call 1-800-269-7538, and you can join now, right over the phone. And until May 8th, your first year of membership is just $49. That's $10 off the regular price. As a AAA member, you'll get lots of other valuable services too, including free maps, discounts, and more. I would describe my family as a AAA family. There's never been a better time to join, so call now. When you're out in the middle of nowhere and you got your card, you're happy you got it. Call 1-800-269-7538 now. Howdy, folks. Cliff here, riding the range and thinking about IHOP's big two-egg breakfast. Yes, sir, nothing handles a powerful hunger like two eggs, two buttermilk pancakes, four pieces of bacon or sausage, and hash browns. It's a mighty big meal for mighty big appetites. I'll have the big two-egg breakfast, please. <laughs> oh, and a short stack for Old Comet. Big two-egg breakfast, $2.99, Monday through Friday, $2.99 at IHOP now. So, gentlemen, what have you got? Three tickets. Two accidents and a suspended license. You lose. Not when you call Eastwood. If you're paying more than $50 a month for auto insurance, call Eastwood now at 1-800-468-LESS. You want auto insurance you can afford? You call Eastwood. Eastwood. We're in the Pacific Bell Smart Yellow Pages under insurance. Have bad credit? Tired of being turned down for a car loan? At Cars Yes, we say yes. Yes, we have financing even if you've been turned down elsewhere. Yes, we carry a huge selection of all makes and models, and we warranty all of our used cars at no extra cost. Yes, 
It's Cars Yes. Call 1-800-CARS-YES for the location nearest you. I would like for you to be the boxer boy. Oh, you would like me to be the boxer boy? I promise you, I fear no challenge. I will be in these little silk shorties by the end of the show. Oh, man. <laughs> hey, listen, we've got Rhonda outside. She's uh, had an indecent proposal for Alex, our very, very kind local cobbler, to dress up in a chicken suit and offer free shoe shines in his store two doors up. Uh, Rhonda, you there? Let's Gordon, take it. this is so exciting. People are lined up down the block to have their shoes shined by Alex the Wonder <laughs> Chicken. Alex, get back in the Shoes. Shine, shine, look, get down there. Look at them, they're shining everything. They're shining uh, tennis shoes, they're shining socks. Oh. Alex is a fabulous shiner, what a, you what know? What a lovely man. Give Alex a big round of applause. Come on, everybody, give Alex a big round of applause out here. Terrific. Yay. All righty. Now listen, we have one more bit of business. Remember the indecent proposal we made to Tony who came out? We said we'll make him an honorary boxer boy for 50 bucks. Yeah. Well, I believe he's ready to show his stuff as only. A man of the rippling sexuality of Tony Stan and Kent. You ready? Tony, come on out! Come, come here. Uh, how does it feel to be the rippling love hunk adored by millions as you stand here? Uh, it's, it's a fantasy. It's, it's unexplainable. Yeah, yeah, it is. Uh, and it's also unrepeatable. The, F, the FCC have rules against things like this for good reason. Okay, when we come back, we're going to have Rhonda back in the studio with a story of her own indecent proposal she made to her boyfriend. And yes, I will get into those boxer shorts. If Tony's going to be good enough to do it, I'll do it. When we return on the Gordon Elliott Show. For your complimentary tickets to the Gordon Elliott Show in New York, give us a call at 212-975-8540 and please be sure to leave us your phone number. People sometimes ask me why I seem so angry in my television commercials. Well, the truth is I am angry. I'm angry when big insurance companies take advantage of little people. I'm angry when ordinary folks get hurt in car and motorcycle accidents and get taken by the system. I'm angry at insurance company lawyers who try to keep accident victims from collecting everything they're entitled to. Yeah, I'm angry. But if you've been injured in an accident, you need someone to get angry for you. So call me at 1-800-333-0000. Fighting for you is my job. Are you dating a Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde? Are you always wondering whether your lover will be naughty or nice? Call us at 1-800-77-GORDO. Welcome back. I dare you to accept my indecent proposal today's show. And, of course, Tony has taken the biggest dare of all. He has uh, become our token boxer boy for today. Looking good, Tony. Looking good. And i got to go over for a reality check because uh, reality, who, that's his real name. You've heard the code word, which is flashed on the bottom of your screen. How many times? Yeah. How many times? Twelve times? Yeah. So right. this is your twelfth slice of pizza? Yeah, no, I missed a couple. Okay, so you got to eat those two more before we go. How much more do I owe you for $10 a slice of pizza? I owe you another $40? Uh -huh. You're going to end up eating 14 slices of oh, pizza my. before the end of the show. You're going to burst, my golly. I just don't want to be... I, we... I don't want to sit next to the guy on the subway. That's all on the way home. But let's welcome back Ron Shear, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Now, Rhonda, Alex was a real honey. He dressed in a chicken suit and gave the shoe shine. He did it for nothing. He didn't even want the 50 bucks. <laughs> he loved it. But Those you, people were all lined up. Now, you, you came on the show because you have, a, you have an offer you want to make to a man in your life. Well, I, <laughs> I will offer my boyfriend sex five times a day if he gives up ESPN. Really? <laughs> <laughs> if he gives up all sports. Really? Yes. For how long? 
Forever, the rest for, of our lives. For, forever? Well, yep. however long uh, that relationship lasts. <laughs> <laughs> a mind <laughs> You'll be a busy girl. You'll be worked to the bone, so to speak, Rhonda. He's not giving up sports. Oh, really? You no feel way. safe How and making... How many guys would do, take that offer? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, it's, come on, baby. Let's go. It's a sport. You're a little setup. You look like a sports animal, don't you? Sure. Okay, this means no more Super Bowl. That's all right. That's all right. Five times a day, right? Five times a day. <laughs> Dream on. <laughs> okay. We're going to go to break. When we come back, I fulfill my promise. I get into the boxer shorts. When we return on the Golden Gallery. Air travel provided by United Airlines. Come fly the airline that spans more than half the world. United. Come fly the friendly skies. My child needed braces, and I thought I couldn't afford them. That's when I heard about Dr. Beecham's Western Dental Centers. They had a low monthly payment plan that I could easily afford. There was no down payment, and I paid no interest. You can afford quality dental care at Dr. Beecham's Western Dental Centers. Simply call toll-free 1-800-6-DENTAL. Call now, 1-800-6-DENTAL for a no-charge consultation. We have an office near you, and we're open evenings and Saturdays. We make quality dental care affordable for everyone. Need a full or part-time job? Want to earn extra money and meet interesting people? In two weeks, you can be fully trained as a professional bartender and ready to work. Learn by doing, like on the job training. Job placement is available. For over 25 years, graduates have found jobs locally and nationwide. Day and evening classes are starting soon. Call now. Don't delay. 1-800-736-1001, Professional Bartender School. If you'd like to order a video cassette of The Gordon Elliott Show for only $24.95, just call Video Archives at 1-800-FOR-VIDEO. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. And you asked for it. You wanted to see it. Well, here it is in my boxer shorts. What the clock? I'm wearing it. Oh, you like this? It's a beautiful look. Hey. I just want to, I just want to let you know, ladies and gentlemen, that this is a specially designed sweep back. It's from Vera. It's from Vera Wing. Love it. But you know, that's, uh, that's about it. But I want to thank our guests for their terrific participation in today's show and taking their indecent proposal so well. And I wish you luck. And Rhonda, you're, it's, you're very special. You, Please come you back. You did it for me. Thank, thank you. Thank you, darling. <laughs> I got it. And we'll see you again next time. We'll see you next show. Cheerio, America. paid by 